fucking justice. Damn. Look, Mary, those protocols are a one-way trip. A bad one. I know that. All right. All right. Just take a deep breath. Tell me what happened. In the last 24 hours, I've lost my job, my home base. I've started having blackouts. I destroyed my apartment at super speed. I attacked my team, my family. Jefferson, I attacked innocent people, dozens of them, and I don't remember doing it. I'm out of control. Easy. In my experience, there's almost nothing that can't be undone, but I'm gonna need you to calm down for me. Calm down? I'm losing my mind. Look, you know the contingency plan. The injustice protocols were put into place for a reason, to protect the world when one of us goes rogue. It's happening, Jefferson. You have to take away my powers. We don't have time. No, no, Cara, John, Sarah, we all designed this plan together after Faust. And we all made the same promise. If anyone ever lost control, a designated teammate would step in. For me, that's you. And I don't carry that weight lightly. What if this is all temporary? What if your mind starts healing? It's, it's not going to heal. It's only going to get worse. But how can you say that for sure? I forgot Joe died. The man who raised me. He passed away six months ago, and I can't remember it at all. Look, I know you have questions, but I'm losing myself. You took an oath. If I ever said the word injustice, you'd listen. Please. We have to do this now. Father had a saying, one that I even teach my students today. Where's the future? Right here. Whose life is this? Mine. What are you going to do with it? Live it by any means necessary. So don't worry. I will honor my promise. I will do whatever is necessary to keep folks alive. But remember, when we take away your powers, they are gone permanently. <laughs> 